Brand spanking new. about the deck it's forged and not it's uh forged it's a welded deck instead of a stamp deck so it's thicker it's a lot thicker you can even see here how thick that plate is compared to a stamp deck close and then you see the edge here they for they doubled it up so when you hit something you don't bend it in and that's all welded in place too isn't it there's two clean outs there's one on this side and one on that side so you can really get the deck cleaned off they and probably then, don't work with the shit well the nice part about this whole thing is Pull this off right here. And that's how you get to the blade, the, the belts. The belts. It's a lot easier to get to the belts now. Before you just have to unbolt the cover. This is one big belt, ain't it? Mm -hmm. All right. So what'd you say? This is a twin. Yeah, it's V twin. V twin. So you got one spark plug. One spark plug. One valve cover. Valve cover. Spark over here. Valve cover. Twenty-three horse. Twenty-three horse Kawasaki. You ought to be able to cut some shit with that, couldn't you? Yeah, if you ever got to push this thing right here, is push your parking brake release. You push that in and let, click it in the hole, then you can push the motor. Okay. You have to get it somewhere if it dies or something like that, and you can't get it to start. You think something like that, they would put a little bit bigger gas tank on it, but it is what it is. I think it's three gallon. Uh, I got my cavity book. two. Okay, two gallon then. When you buy this, it comes with a clear hose you stick on there to do your old changes so you don't get the deck all dirt, the frame all dirty. What do you put a hose on that for it to yeah, drain? Yeah, there's a clear hose you run off of there, down, off the deck. All right. And here's your oil filter right here, so it's really How do you easy. drain it? You just unscrew it right here? Yeah, open that up and drain right out. All right. Down right now. But here's the lift here. Oh, look where I lifted it. The air filter. There's the carburetor. And the bowl underneath there. Real simple to work so on. So when it's carburetor, not fuel injected? Yeah, this model's carburetor. You can buy a different model that's fuel injected. All right. I like carburetor because I can work on them. That's Did not see that. You said... That's eighth inch steel there. If not, yeah, three sixteenths maybe. A little yeah. bit more than an eighth, ain't it? But it came with a trailer hitch? Yeah, tow hitch. And uh, if that's set too high, you can flip it around or you can drop it down to another set of holes and whichever way you need to. Lower it down if it's too high. Yeah. And it's actually all heavy gauge steel, too. It ain't going nowhere. You're not going to tow a boat, but you can pull stuff around your yard. I've seen it. To. He was saying the muffler is all encased inside here. So you're not really going to get burned on it. Is it? So in case people wonder if they're short, he said you got four adjustments there. Yeah, you unscrew that and there's a slide, the full adjustment. So you got four and a half inches where if you go all the way down to here on the edge of that you really got five inches of adjustment that'd be really yeah and then this is your safety switch for your seat that freaking deflector shield is not lightweight that thing is thick it's inline fuel filter fuel pump and to replace it's what 28 dollars 28 dollars and the fuel filter a uh, buck or two yeah and then it runs straight over to the carburetor so it's actually easy on the fuel system to keep it clean if you need to replace the fuel pump, it's cheap. There's future lawn care right there. <laughs> One steer on each side. <laughs> we'll see how it does. Brand new, out of the box. He's not cutting grass today. Easter egg hunt coming up this weekend. So uh, if you like it, subscribe. You'll see how this thing cuts. He's going to be like doing his own maintenance on it. The oil changes, everything else to see how that all goes. And uh, he's one that actually works on it. So if you do have any questions, it might be the one to come to. Yeah, you got any questions on how to get to something, let me know. We may tear apart a new motor just to show you. Other than that, uh, have a nice day. We'll see you on the next video. You're going to see more on this one.